What is going on guys? It is your boy Beakers and we are here for another episode of the Ultra Sun Randomized Nuzlocke. And in today's episode, we have a new family member. We are going to be going and kicking some butt in today's episode. Hopefully. And... I don't know. I think saving the girl damsel in distress? Maybe? Ah! But... If you are ready for today's episode, hit the like, comment, subscribe, all that good shenanigans and jazz. If you did not get to watch the last episode, we did training, we fought a few battles, we lost a member. So you might want to go back and check that out before you get any spoilers. But, with all that being said, let's get a family recap and see exactly who the new member is. And survey says, our new family member is, of course, Flash, the Zora. With Heart Stamp, Karate Chop, Thunder Punch, Slash, Snow Cloak, and the Lucky Egg. I decided not to do training, and I'm just going to slap the Lucky Egg on him. We are going to switch train, and hope for the best, because unfortunately, I do not have time to do any more training currently before this video goes out on Monday. Then we also got Shades the Crooked Dial with Crunch, Karate Chop, Heart Stamp, Dig with the Iron Fist Ability, and the black glasses. Then we also got Tortuga, our Hitmon Lee, with high jump kick, blaze kick, fake out, and heart stamp. Then we also got Scott, our Dugong, with Ice Shard, Psy Shock, Aqua Jet, Aurora Beam, Power Construct, holding that Mystic Water. Then, of course, we got Peter, our Talon Flame, with Flare Blitz, that we got in the last episode, thanks to Sketch, with Roost, Fire Fang, Acrobatics, Light Metal, and the Sky Plate. You know what? I need to take off the Sky Plate so Acrobatics actually does damage. Then, of course, we have the one, the own, the MVP of the squad, the team, the family, Hot Mess, the Gorgeist, with Jump Kick, Shadow Sneak, Raise Leaf, Leech Seed, with the Nero Force ability still holding on to that Rose Incense because, I mean, look at it. He's a plant. He's a pumpkin. He's holding out that Rose going, Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. I was wrong, and our team has fallen apart. But let's head back over to the Ether Paradise, where that's got to be like the death area for us because we have lost more mons in the Ether Paradise than we have lost in the entire series. <laughs> At least that's how it feels. I just hit my mic again. And by the way, guys, I am trying a few different things during recording uh, during my recording sessions. So in the last recording, I tried I tried to figure out why my game was glitching out a little bit and being very, very slow. And I couldn't quite figure it out. So what I did is I went in and I tried to do some research on Citra and everything like that. And lo and behold, the graphics that I was using were absolutely booty. So I did some changing, I got everything fixed, and might I say, the game looks way better. <laughs> the game looks way better. Then I'm like, you know what, on top of that, let's go ahead and do some research on OBS, which is actually what I use to record all my stuff. Lo and behold, I was not recording on the best video bit rate, and I wasn't using the correct audio bit rate so i'm hoping that this video comes out quite a bit better and if it doesn't oh well i can change it back what it was if it comes out superb and you know i'm in i'm in i'm in love with the recording then we're gonna keep it like this and you know for the see for for foreseeable future because i realized in some of the case uh, let's just get into the game and i'll do some talking uh, my, my, what naughty children. You should just lay your heavy hands down. But I knew that you would struggle onward. I could see through every action you would take. So I knew you would re try to reach the president. And that is why I knew I would be able to ambush you here, just in front of the mansion where the president remains. Hen. Redeem my previous failure. The only reason I let you to the lower floors was to buy time. Oh, wow, Mr. Faba, you're so nice. You bought time. <laughs> well, of course, I am a wonderful branch chief after all. 
We didn't even have to ask you where the president was, and you just confirmed it for us. So the president is up ahead, huh? Thanks. Now we know where to find Cosma, Lily. What? <laughs> Oh, enough! You want teach these children a lesson? Ah, oh, we don't have time for this. Help me out, Beakers. And here comes another double battle, if I'm not mistaken. So we're gonna see how my game reacts to another double battle, because all these are double battles, and I hate double battles. So far, so good. They're both cyclists. They're both MIA, so they're missing in action. Got you. Lorantis and Plusel. My game is still going good. My game is still going good. And this looks beautiful! I can't believe I was using the wrong graphics this whole entire time. And there goes the game. It starts slowing down again. Actually, it's the same speed as before. So I'm not too upset. It's a little slower than before now. Little. Not a lot. Enough to make you go, oh boy. Uh, I, I shouldn't be that scared of a plusle. Should not be that scared of a plusle, but I'm going to bring out hot mess. I'm going to bring out hot mess because here's my thought process. I don't want to lose another mon, period. I need to bring back in flash and I feel like plusle has thunder. That's what I'm scared of. And I knew this thing had, it has like, no, that's Serena. So this thing had like Leaf Blade or Solar Blade or something like that. So I am scared of both of them. However, Hot Mess is our MVP and I know I don't have to... You just hit your teammate. And you paralyzed your teammate. Thank you, Plusle. Paralyzed. Got the tell. Hot Mess is the only one that didn't get paralyzed. Yeah. At least I hit both of you guys. So you guys can't do diddly squat now. But... Yeah, my thought process is getting really, really weird as of right now. And I just want to make sure we don't lose anybody again. Because I, do I don't want to do any more training. I don't. I really don't. The area that I have for training is not very good. And I just want it to go away. I want another area to train. If that is the case, you're going to discharge again. That is fine. Keep doing the damage. I'm going to get rid of Plusle. Lorantis is going to go down in HP, and I still can't believe how much cleaner this game looks by changing one thing. One thing. That's all I had to... Hey! And we got rid of the Lorantis thanks to our partner in crime that was sitting next to us. Thank you for that. I really do appreciate it. That's a Con Kelder. Okay, and a Talon Flame. Okay, so now I need to change my concept again. We have a Talon Flame, who is a fire and flying. And we have a Con Kelter, who is a fighting type. Scott's not my answer. Shades is not my answer. Tortuga's not my answer. Oh my gosh, Flash is my answer. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. No, I'm bringing in Peter. I am bringing in Peter. I'm not doing it. I'm not, I am not going to put someone out there that is going to get absolutely wrecked right now. Not doing it. Uh-uh. Not going to do it. All right. So there's the speed race. Hot tail putting you. Okay. Who am I battling? Am I battling with how? Am I battling with how? I need to figure out who I'm battling with. Because they are putting in the finest of work. I still have an item on this thing. Acrobat isn't going to do as much. Oh my gosh. I am not thinking fully. Like I said. I, I'm trying to think. And thinking doesn't work. No. No, 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 no. Peter. 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 I outspeed. I know I outspeed. Peter is a boss. I overlevel you. And flying is faster than fighting. Go away. Peter. Peter. Seed Bomb. Do we really want Seed Bomb? Do we really want Seed Bomb? 
I can teach you jump kick again. We haven't used jump kick. I'm gonna I'm gonna do seed bomb. The only reason I'm keeping the razor leaf is because double battles are a thing right now, and I don't want anything to happen. Peter, my man. <laughs> Wait, is that the name off of Deadpool? Was it Peter? That one guy who has no superpowers? I think his name was Peter. I'm trying to go back. Deadpool 2. Deadpool 2 when, they, when they're making the team. I think his name was Peter. But I was thinking of Family Guy when I nicknamed this thing Peter. But now I'm just thinking like this is like my, my um, I'm not going to say MVP. Because Hot Mess is MVP by far. There is no changing that at this point. But I think he's like a, like a runner up. Like, he's, he's in the running. Because Peter has taken care of a lot of things for us in the last few episodes. And I can't thank Peter enough for this. And I'm just like, I love Peter. I love him. <laughs> how, how can this be to be cornered by mere children? Me ah, maybe helping one another out isn't so bad. Beakers, how I leave Fava to you. Weren't we just battling Faba? I swear we were just battling Faba. Wait, is Faba gonna have six? Faba might have six. Hold up! <laughs> Enough. I will show you the true power of Brad's chief Faba, the man who is called Ethan Paradise's last line of defense. We will settle this with one last multi battle. Okay, I was battling with Gl Gladian. Or Gladian, or whatever his name is. That's why he was helping out. Oh, come on, because I know Incineroar and the rest of our Pokemon feel the same way. We can save Lily and Cosmog for sure. All right, slow battle again. But at least you know we're we're we're, we're doing our thing. Baba's gonna have six. I can't tell if Baba's gonna have six or not. All right, so now I have to mess with the fact that we are also on a slow emulator of Citra right now. So I think my goal is to get rid of Meowstic. Oh my gosh. The game is going to go down the tube. So we... Oh, I know why it's going so slow right now. I know exactly why it's going so slow. And it's not because there's four mods on the team or anything like that on the field or any. It's because it's Flash. We added Flash to the team. And he's going so fast that everything is going slow. That makes perfect sense now. I'm just trying to make logic beyond what's going on right now that is a fairy type and i have shades out i do not like that however i want to get rid of meowstic and not slurp buff you can't touch me meowstic i'm a dark type i love nine tails actually i kind of want to watch naruto now that i finished i was scared of a fairy move i had no idea that that thing had energy ball Okay, uh, so we may have to change what we're doing right now. That's an electrode. Uh, I want to use dig. But that thing outsped me, and I know electrode will as well. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I don't have an answer for a fairy type at all. The steel typing was my... It, Poles was my answer for a fairy type, and we lost it in the last episode. If you didn't... Spoiler, you might as well go check that out. Um, and I can't bring out Peter because Electrode's just going to use Explosion. Hot Mess is my answer. Hot Mess is my answer, and I swear, if Nine Tails attacks Hot Mess, I'm going to lose my mind. Magnet Rise. So Dig wouldn't have done diddly squat to this thing. I'm glad I switched out. Is that from Nine Tails? Must have been. You can energy ball me all you want. Ain't gonna do diddly squat. Now the hot misses. Oh, okay. You lowered my special defense. But is this... 
I don't know. I'm thinking all over the place right now. Leech seed. Do I leech seed them both? No, I raise a leaf. I raise a leaf. It hits both. But what I was trying to say in the very last episode as well is we hit 1K, guys. We hit 1K. We finally hit 1K. And I just want to say while we're in this battle of trying to live is thank you thank you guys we did it and i put it in twitter so if you haven't been following me on twitter highly recommend you go do that it's in the description down below you can always go check that out as well but i say we because we are a family we are a family and we finally got to that point that doesn't do anything to me i am a ghost type electrode Go die. You just exploded yourself and did absolutely nothing, just like other animes. When they decide to explode themselves and everyone survives. <laughs> so there's no point in self-destructing. None of it. Uh, for example, Dragon Ball Z. Cell explodes and actually the... <laughs> Spoiler! If you haven't watched it at all. But Goku dies. Goku technically dies. I will give you that. Wait, does he die? Yeah, he does. He does die. Same thing with uh, everyone else uh, that he that uh, the, that is on that. Is it a world? Is it an island? Technically, to me, I consider it. It's weird because it's a world, but it's it, it's it's an island to space. If that makes any sense at all. Well, technically, planets are islands to space. That's trippy. <laughs> That's trippy. I never thought about that. You didn't have six. You only had three. Yeah, I am down to clown with that. I am down to clown. And that was a Raichu. We got rid of the Raichu with ease. Oh, I want to help save Lily. So I'm going ahead. Don't mind. You don't mind, right? Ah, big old smile. Ah. See, he's trying to stop us this whole time and then gives us the key to go in. How does that make any sense? Thanks for giving us the key, Mr. Faba. You've been a big help. I don't understand. Oh, this is why I can't bring myself to like children. All you had to do was hold on to the key. And everything would have been fine. Everything would have been fine. We are fully healed. We are fully... Oh, we're going to be going through a gauntlet now. That's right. Okay. You're going to say the same thing. Okay. I am very scared. I'm very scared, but we are going to be going through a straight up gauntlet now. And I know... And there's Guzma. We're st I just realized we're starting to get closer and closer to the end of the game. We are. We're getting very close. And it's starting to scare me more and more. Not gonna lie. Oh, there's like an ook billion Team Skull thugs in this place. So, the foundation really was working together with Team Skull. This is like way too mind blowing to think about right now. Biggest, let's knock some scores together for now. Hold up. Before we do that, how? 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 I, if I'm not mistaken, eh, it was a berry. It was a berry. I knew there was an item over here. I think there's a sticker on the other side? Because I never even knew that we could walk this far until I was like doing some more research on Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, trying to remember exactly where everything. No, there's an item. Ugh. 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 No, give me away. Give me away from the Pelipper. No. No, that trash can. Why do you have trash up on a balcony? You, do, you don't do it. Why do you have trash on a balcony? All right. It is time to take on the gauntlet of. T of Team Skull. I don't think I ever really heard of this music before. But. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what? I gotta keep the boss from getting his hands dirty, so I'm gonna wreck you myself. Alright. Let's go. Um, but while I was I was saying that whole thing, but we are a family. Thank you guys for the 1K. I really do appreciate it. This is only a stepping stone. It really Oh I was waiting for that mega. I was waiting for that mega. Because the last time we faced a Metagross, it had a um what do we do? You're a steel type. I think Shades is my answer. I think Shades is my answer. But the last time we fought a Metagross was Guzma. Guzma actually had a Metagross. And he, didn't he have a Mega? Yeah, because I said something along the lines of Revenge of the Metagross. Because <laughs> Metagross is looking for his revenge. He really, really is. And I don't like it. So, you're going to scary face me twice. That's fine. Shades is slow already, so I'm just gonna dig. You're gonna miss your attack if you even go for one. Agility. You're already fast. Okay, that makes no sense to me from an AI or a computer's perspective. Wouldn't it be smarter than that? It already slowed me down twice. It's speeding up. Wait, does that mean it has nothing to hit me with? It might be because it has nothing to hit me with. That's all you've gone for, is scary face and agility. Okay, that was actually really easy. It might not have had anything. Okay, you want to learn Wild Charge Flash. It also damages the user a little. It's definitely stronger than Thunder Punch. And do I have a lot of Psychic type? No, I have a lot of Fighting Moves. All right, we'll get rid of Karate Chop for now. Just for now. Just for now, I can always reteach you Karate Chop if need be, but I want to keep Thunder Punch so I don't hurt myself as well. All right, one down, two to go. I think I think we got this. This little gauntlet is nothing. It all depends on what keeps popping out. Like that Metagross was definitely scary. I love Metagross. I'm very scared of Metagross, but oh no. So Team Skull has come out with an Alakazam and a Metagross. But here's the kicker. Here's the kicker. Both of them can be Megas. And I've been very scared of both of them being Megas. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. You know, on the bright side is I have Crunch. And in this gen is a physical move, Telekinesis. Is that for him or for me? Wait. I thought... Is it Kinesis then? Does Alakazam learn Telekinesis and Kinesis? K Kinesis? -is 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 -is? Uh, because I thought Kinesis was for evasiveness. But apparently it hurled me into the air with Telekinesis. And I don't know what that does. I'm going to be completely honest. I have no idea what that does. Oh, you're not going to battle me. You're not going to battle me. Okay. Hold up. Before we continue on. I don't... I don't want to switch train against Guzma. So, we haven't seen Tortuga yet. We are going to bring out him. And we are going to be facing off against Guzma. Ah, oh, so I'm still not strong enough. All the days that I struggled alone and lonely, it was all for nothing, is that it? That's right, I made his voice Waluigi. So, hold up. Hold up. Gotta get some water for this one. Me, 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 me. Waluigi, the headed boss who beats you down and beats you down and never lets up. Yeah, big bad Guzma is here. As my face is getting bright red from doing this. I did that spoiled little brat a favor and crushed him. Yeah, that was me. This is not Wario anymore. A Waluigi. Wario. Whatever. Hey, Wario. Wario. That's Wario. Yo. Yeah, I kind of liked you, kid. Leaving home like that and wanting to get stronger and stronger. You had some real guts. Going so far as coming to Team Skull and rejecting your own mother. I, that was impressive. 
I don't know what kind of voice I'm giving him anymore. And now it's your turn, you little misfits. Keep getting up in my grill like a crowd of... Like a cloud of smoke that I can't brush away. It's time I put you in your place. I have given all these characters so many different voices. It's insane. I can't even remember anymore. All right, Guzmo, what do you got? You are... You're a gentleman. You got your six mons. That means you're not going to have anything. Rotom. That's a Rotom. It's Rotom fan. That's not good for Hitmon Lee. What are the odds that it would be Rotom... Uh, it's got imposter. You just took my wide lens. Okay. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little scared. Because I know I have an answer for this in the back. But how do you back down from a fight that's a copycat of yourself? That's like when Vegeta goes up against himself. You don't do that. Okay. Acrobatics. Get rid of this thing, because now it's a fighting type. I actually liked Hitmonlee. Hitmonlee can't do a bunch, but I liked Hitmonlee. Skunk Tank's out now. Who would have been perfect for a Skunk Tank? Hitmonlee. Um, alright. You know, I hate to say it, and I hate to put it this way too, though. But on the bright side is Hitmon Lee was the weakest link of the team, even with Zora being lower leveled. I hate to say that, but it's truth. It's the truth. And I also know that ground is super effective against poison type and water does not make it neutral. So this should get rid of Skunk Tank pretty easy. And this is level 45. I just looked at that. I hope we're prepared for this. I really do. I hope we are prepared for this, because this is going to get... Bear Tick! Who would have been perfect for it? Hitmon Lee! Um, we don't have a fighting move on Flash anymore. Shade still has a fighting move, right? Shade has Karate Chop. Yeah, Shade has Karate Chop. This should do good damage. Oh my gosh, Bear Tick is thick. What is this? You freeze with Blizzard. You know, on the bright side, Shades, thank you for living. Um, what do I do? What do I do? Because if I bring out Peter, Blizzard's going to kill me. I think Scott's my only option. The last time a bear tick popped out, Scott was my option too. Okay. Guzma, you need to calm down. I was going to lose everything in this world if it crit me. Well, crit me. No, if it froze me, that was my response. Bear tick, I need you to go away. Bear tick's got rest. Bear tick's got rest. Okay. Okay, hold up. I'm 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 thinking here. I'm thinking. I am thinking. One turn because rest rest your you're asleep for two turns. Flare blitz. And we get rid of the bear tick. And we get rid of the bear tick. I know that's a lot of recoil, but Peter has got this. Peter coming in clutch. Me first. I'm good. I'm good, Peter. Your move your moveset's quite good right now. Seismitoad. Uh hot mess is our answer for that one. I hate I hate we lost Hitmonlee. I really, really do. Now we have to add another member to the team, but at least after this recording session, I can do some training, which would be fantastic. Seismitoad has Grassy Surge. 
That's right, when I was battling them in the wild, they had Grassy Surge, which made this kind of battle easy. Rain Dance and Grassy Surge. You know, I feel like in a situation like this, if you have like Grassy Surge, I think Sunny Day or Rain Dance should amplify Grassy Surge in some way, shape, or form. I, I, I really do. I think if you use that kind of combination, it should be like more generation of health or something because gr technically grass grows in the water and the sun. It all, well, technically the sun can burn grass and the water can flood grass. It would be a weird concept, but I think that would be a cool idea. Uh, that is a bug. Peter is going to take care of this thing. Why do I feel like it gets a ground move? I'm a, I'm a flying type. You can't do anything. You can't hit me. You can't hit me. I'm a ground type. I'm a flying type. I can't put you to sleep. Even though you look tired. Look at those eyes on on that bug. He just looks tired. I'm going to use Fire Fang instead of Flare Blitz. Because I think Flare Blitz would... It didn't... It, it, Fire Fang did nothing. Fire Fang did absolutely nothing. I'm not getting healed by the Grassy Surge because I'm above it. Ah, um, I'm very scared to use Flare Blitz. I'm very scared. This thing is a poison bug type. That Venoshock hurt. So did Acrobatics. Okay. The problem is, is my answer for this thing is sitting right, right out here in front of me. Peter. That's my answer for this thing. And I think, depending on the damage. Okay. No, no, I'm not going to, I'm not risking anymore. I am not, no, 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 no. I'm not risking Rufflet. I am using Acrobatics. Peter's got this. Yeah, Peter! Peter is victorious once again. The rain has stopped now. Okay, the battlefield is gone. Cool. Ludico, I am so glad all that stuff went away now that Ludicolo is out here. See, I I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I know it's risky. I know it's risky, but Flash is my answer for this thing because Peter is a fire type as well as a flying type. I am very scared. You are 10 levels above me. We got the para off. Okay, I think that helps out a lot. That, that, that helps out a lot. All right, I'm going to bring out Scott. Because at least we got the para off, which is beautiful. Beautiful. There's a Mega Drain. Okay. I really, really don't like Guzma. Guzma's been giving me a lot of issue. The, the, this half of the game has been giving me a lot of issues. Still going to use Mega Drain. Okay. So, Scott is not my answer to this thing. What is my answer? <laughs> I always have issues with Ludicolos. Uh, I... Can I Leech Seed you? I guess we're gonna find out. I know Nature Power won't be able to hit me, at least. Because it's a Tri-Attack. Parad! Get Parad, you... Fat Ludicolo. You plump Ludicolo. Shadow Sneak does affect, and I have a high physical attack. Yeah, we got the crate. Okay, Shadow, one more Shadow. No, no, I'm going to need two. I'm going to need two Shadow Sneaks to get rid of this big thing. What is Ludicolo, actually? Come to think, you have Astonish. You need something stronger than that, buddy. What is Ludicolo, though? Because technically, Lotad is a lily pad. Lumbre is... A lily pad and then Ludicolo is just a Karibo with a lily pad on top of its head 
That's what I think of Ludicolo. To be completely honest with you guys. Ludicolo is just... I've always had issues with Ludicolo anyways, being a water grass type. I know that it's weak to flying type moves, but Peter couldn't do anything either, being it's a fire type as well. And if I'm not mistaken, I can't believe I can't believe we lost another Mon. No, there's nothing on the I swear there was a sticker and item on the sides or something like that. Anywho, we're gonna end the episode off here. I'm gonna add another Pokemon to the team. Do some more training with the mods that are not completely leveled up yet. So we have some answers, hopefully. And in the next episode, hopefully, we'll have a full team of six for the entire episode. But if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit the like button. Su subscribe to be a part of the Beaker's Brigade. And don't forget to go into that comment section because it is greatly, greatly appreciated. And I love reading all you guys' comments. But see you guys in the very next episode. And I will see you guys very, very soon.